This is Paul. Yes. <laughs> now, this idea that the court is the process, right? Uh huh. You schedule the court hearing. Yes. And the RCW say that two attempts of personal service must be made. Yep. And then it can be uh, service by mail pursuant to a court order. Yes. Are there courts that would be required to employ an actual process server? <clears throat> I know for a lot of small cities, Port Townsend, yes, Squim, mm -hmm. Port Angeles. <laughs> Let's say that somebody mm -hmm, wanted to know where I was at. <laughs> and um, the court had to pay $65 or maybe even $150 to serve the individual. <laughs> you know how strapped they are for actual funds there in the court. <laughs> but what is the importance of having proof of service prior to having a court hearing? <laughs> So the individual knows that they are required to appear in court. Yes. What happens when you don't give them notice of court hearings? Do they actually believe they're required to appear in court? No. Are you sure about that? <laughs> because I thought courts were so poor right now that they forgot that they could actually employ a process server. Yes. To go find the individual. <clears throat> now, it looks like that the police and sheriff's department. Yes have taken over this idea of serving the individual. Right, right. But is that your actual job? <coughs> Let's say, <coughs> is it your job <coughs> as a police or sheriff's department to do the court process of the court itself? <coughs> or is the court obligated <coughs> to have proof of service of process because the court is liable to pay for service of process. <laughs> now, you'd say you'd add it to my fines and fees, wouldn't you? You'd say, well, eventually we get the guy to pay for it. Yes. But as I look at this personal recognizance, Judge Landis. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, on personal recognizance. Yeah. You're by defendant release county jail pending trial in the following conditions. Yes. Now, down here. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um, the defendant shall appear in court on November 1st of 2017 at 9 a.m. Yes. And I did ap appear in court. Yes, I did. But is it the court's responsibility to employ the process server? Mm -hmm. Looks like sheriffs and police officers have been helping themselves to some additional funding that they don't have any legal right to have. <laughs> now, I read the above conditions of release and any other conditions that may be attached. Mm -hmm. I agree to follow such conditions, understand the violation will lead to my arrest and may be punishable by contempt of court. Now, since I do realize that this this warning here of if you're disobedient to this, okay, you it may lead to your arrest and punishment for contempt of court. That's right. That's right. Does that mean that because my public defender said, well, you do what I say, I don't have to give you notice. I think they were obligated to give me notice. So the 27 days I spent in jail, 